Corinthian Bet, Chapter 4 Therefore, having this service, even as we received compassion, we do not lose heart, but have renounced the secret ways of shame, not walking in craftiness nor falsifying the word of Elohim, but by the manifestation of the truth, recommending ourselves to every human conscience in the sight of Elohim. And indeed, if our good news has been veiled, it has been veiled in those who are perishing, in whom the mighty one of this age has blinded the minds of the unbelieving, so that the enlightening of the good news of the esteem of Messiah, who is the likeness of Elohim, does not shine on them. For we do not proclaim ourselves, but Messiah Yahashua the Master, and ourselves your servants for the sake of Yahashua. For Elohim who said, Let light shine out of darkness, is the one who has shone in our hearts for the enlightening of the knowledge of the esteem of Elohim in the face of Yahashua Messiah. And we have this treasure in earthen vessels, so that the excellence of the power might be of Elohim and not of us, being hard pressed on every side, but not crushed, being perplexed, but not in despair, being persecuted, but not forsaken, being thrown down, but not destroyed, always bearing about in the body the dying of the Master Yahashua, that the life of Yahashua might also be manifested in our body. For we, the living, are always delivered to death for the sake of Yahashua, that the life of Yahashua might also be manifested in our mortal flesh, so that death indeed is working in us, but the life in you. But having the same spirit of belief, according to what has been written, I believed, therefore I spoke, we also believe, therefore we also speak, knowing that he who raised up the master Yahashua shall also raise us up through Yahashua, and shall present us with you. For all this is for your sake, so that favor, having spread through the many, would cause thanksgiving to overflow unto the esteem of Elohim. Therefore we do not lose heart, but even if our outward man is perishing, the inward man is being renewed day by day. For this slight momentary pressure is working for us a far more exceeding and everlasting weight of esteem. We are not looking on what is seen, but on what is not seen. For what is seen passes away, but what is not seen is everlasting.